can sit right there, ma'am. Ma'am, I see you're holding some paper. Has the jury been able to reach a verdict in, the, in any of these counts? Yes, sir. All right, if you would, please hand the paper to the bailiff. Ms. Gregg, please rise and come to the podium. Along with your attorneys. All right, the verdicts appear to be in proper form. The verdict of the jury is count one. We, the jury, find the defendant, Carly Madison Gregg, guilty of first degree murder as charged in the indictment. Count two. We, the jury, find the defendant, Carly Madison Gregg, guilty of attempted murder as charged in the indictment. Count three. We, the jury, find the defendant, Carly Madison Gregg, guilty of tampering with evidence as charged in the indictment. Please be seated, Ms. Gregg. Ladies and gentlemen, the jury is custom for the court to poll the jury. I have to do it each time. I'm not being, and for each count, I'm not being rude. The quickest way for me to get through this is to simply point at you and you answer out loud. As to count one, we, the jury, find the defendant, Carly Madison Gregg, guilty of first degree murder as charged in the indictment. Beginning on the first row, ma'am, is that your verdict? Sir, is that your verdict? Yes, sir. Ma'am, is that your verdict? Yes. Sir, is that your verdict? Yes. Ma'am, is that your verdict? You got to answer out loud, ma'am. I'm sorry. Yes. On the back row, sir, is that your verdict? Ma'am, is that your verdict? Ma'am, is that your verdict? Yes. Sir, is that your verdict? Ma'am, is that your verdict? Ma'am, is that your verdict? Yes. Ma'am, is that your verdict? That verdict is proper and, and unanimous. As to count two, we, the jury, find the defendant, Carly Madison Gregg, guilty of attempted murder as charged in the indictment. Beginning on the first row, ma'am, is that your verdict? Yes. Sir, is that your verdict? Yes, sir. Ma'am, is that your verdict? Sir, is that your verdict? Yes. Ma'am, is that your verdict? Yes. On the back row, sir, is that your verdict? Yes, Ma'am, is that your verdict? Ma'am, is that your verdict? Sir, is that your verdict? Ma'am, is that your verdict? Ma'am, is that your verdict? Ma'am, is that your verdict? All three verdicts appear to be unanimous. The court will enroll the verdict. All right, ladies and gentlemen, uh, with you having returned a verdict of guilty in count one and count two of the indictment, we'll now proceed to the sentencing phase of the trial. Any objection? Y'all approach. State have any other witnesses that wish to call? Yes, All right, defense may call any witnesses. Uh, we don't have any witnesses, Your Honor. All right. Does the defense rest its ca case in chief as to sentencing? All right, ladies and gentlemen of the jury, with both sides agreeing to rely on the testimony from the guilt phase, the court will further instruct you at this time. You, the jury, have found the defendant guilty of the crime of first-degree murder in count one. You must now decide whether to impose either a, life, a sentence of life imprisonment in the custody of the Department of Corrections or life imprisonment in the custody of the Department of Corrections with the possibility of parole. The court instructs the jury that you should consider the following factors in making your decision. One, the defendant's chronological age. Two, the defendant's family, home, and environment. Three, the circumstances of the homicide offense. Four, the defendant's incompetencies associated with youth. And five, the defendant's possibility of rehabilitation. The court instructs the jury that when all 12 of you reach and agree upon the defendant's sentence for first degree murder, you shall return the sentence in one of the following forms. If you agree to sentence the defendant to life imprisonment in the custody of the Department of Corrections, your verdict will be as follows. Quote, count one. At, quote, as to count one, we the jury sentence the defendant Carly Mass and Greg to life in prison. Your sentences will be as follows. As to count one, the jury having fixed the verdict at life imprisonment, this court will sentence you to life in prison. As to count two, you'll be sentenced to life in prison. As to count three, you'll be sentenced to ten years to serve. 
You'll be required to pay court cost fees and assessments in the amount of $431.50. Ms. Gray, regarding any appeal of your judgment of conviction and order of sentence and in accordance with Wright v. State 577, Southern 2nd 387, the court wants to inform you that pursuant to Rule 4E of the Mississippi Rules of Appellate Procedure, the notice of appeal required by Rule 3 of such rules shall be filed with the circuit clerk within 30 days after the date of the denial of any motion for a new trial or the date of imposition of sentence, whichever is later. Pursuant to Rule 4E, if you make a timely motion under the Mississippi Rules of Criminal Procedure for a judgment of acquittal notwithstanding the verdict of the jury or for a new trial under Rule 25.1, the time for appeal shall run from the entry of the order denying such motion. Finally, Rule 25.1 subsection C provides that a motion for a new trial must be made within 10 days of entry of the judgment, which includes both adjudication of guilt and sentence. Should you make a decision on the record to appeal, that decision will stand unless a written statement to the contrary signed by you and your attorney is filed with the court. Should you make a decision to waive appeal, that decision will stand unless you give written notice to the court and your attorney prior to expiration of the time in which you perfect an appeal. Should no decision to appeal be made by you, your failure to express a desire to appeal shall be considered a waiver of your right to appeal, and that waiver will stand unless you give written notice to the court and to your attorney prior to expiration of the time in which to perfect an appeal. Have you made a decision to appeal your conviction and sentence? All right. Court will be in recess. Sentences will run concurrently. Let me say it right here.